Today, I am going to solve a problem on the reaction of alkali metal in the presence of liquid ammonia. You can find this problem in CSNA exam 2014 December. Here is the problem. When this benzoic acid which has alkyl moiety in the side chain is treated with sodium in liquid ammonia followed by hydrolysis what is the product the given options are here the first one the triple bond has been reduced to give trans olefin and the aromatic ring has been converted to diene the hydrogen has been added to the carbon atom which has carboxylic acid second one the triple bond has been reduced to give cis olefin this aromatic ring it is same third and fourth the aromatic ring it is same you can see here the hydrogen has been delivered the ortho portion to carboxylic acid but they differ in the stereochemistry of olefin here it is trans here it is cis as soon as you see alkali metal in liquid ammonia sodium in liquid ammonia or lithium in liquid ammonia you have to think of three reactions first one it is birch reduction in this aromatic system is converted into diene so 1 4 diene this very simple system benzene so no problem if you go for electron donating group in this sorry same condition the product whatever you get will be like this so we get enol ether the hydrogen has been added at the ortho position if you go for electron withdrawing group like this that is carboxylic acid I have taken then you get product like this hydrogen is added to the carbon which has electron withdrawing group second reaction it is reduction of alkyne The mechanism of this reaction is not very important but the stereochemistry is very important. When alkyne is treated with alkali metal, it may be lithium or sodium, the presence of liquid ammonia, it gives trans olefin. Hydrogens has been added like this. Is it possible to get cis olefin? This is not related to sodium in liquid ammonia. Is it possible to get Z olefin from alkyne? Yes, it is possible. You can get that by using Lindlor's catalyst. That is nothing but palladium poisoned with barium sulfate. If you go for this condition, you will get Z olefin. If you use sodium in liquid ammonia, you will get E olefin. Third one, it is alpha, beta, unsaturated ketone. To this, 
if you add sodium and liquid ammonia what you get is sodium enolate the mechanism that is single electron transfer mechanism mechanism is not important forms bond with hydrogen and this bond migrates to give enolate further this enolate can be added to an electrophile to give a product like this so these three are most important reactions in which sodium liquid ammonia is used the given problem there is aromatic ring as well as triple bond both can undergo reaction with sodium in liquid ammonia alkyne they are reduced to give trans olefin so these two possibilities are the you will not get z olefin since it is carboxylic acid electron withdrawing group we get this product so hydrogen is added to the carbon which has electron withdrawing group so we get this product not this one if it is ome then you will get product like this thank you for watching have a nice day